I should be impatient. As you can hear, yeah, I've kind of got this, uh, this, this cold that's been brewing on me for the past few days. And, uh, it's kind of annoying. Just kind of been, uh, I've just had the coughs, you know? And, uh, kind of started, it snuck up on me, like, around, around Thursday. And... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where it uh, where it came from or anything like that. Just kind of Thursday, I had the coughs and then scratchy throat. It's not COVID. I took a test. It also wouldn't make any sense. Like it's nothing with my lungs. I have like full range of senses. Like I can smell. It's all that. But uh, yeah, just scratchy throat, congested head. Can't hear super well. You know, like when the like all this stuff kind of gets clogged up. But. Um, but yeah, I'd like to, yeah, so the plan for today, what I'd like to do is open up our old friend, Affinity Designer. Yeah, I, I feel like I get a cold, like, once a year or so, kind of, I feel like there's a cold, at least once, creeps through somehow makes it but it didn't happen last year and um, it did happen this year yeah yeah that's what I was thinking like it's probably more likely to happen now that uh, I'm seeing fewer people and when I suddenly do go to the grocery store or, you know catch some random thing But it's fine, I got some cough drops here. <clears throat> and uh, some vitamin water. Not like the brand, but some water with vitamins in it. And uh, it's all good. Today, uh, it's, it was actually a pretty, pretty fun, uh, chill weekend. Um, I've been watching the... Turn on the music. It's kind of loud. I've been watching the, uh, the International, the Dota world championship uh it was super fun to watch uh i mean different folks you know maybe not in the esports but it's uh i mean everyone loves a good underdog story and this year was was one one for the books uh it was really incredible um it was it was a team that basically no one had really ever paid attention to the players no one had ever heard of they came in through the open qualifiers, so that they didn't even go through like the normal. Hey, what's up, Clyde? Uh, they didn't even make it through like the normal like season, like to accumulate points. They had to go through open qualifiers. They squeaked out, barely even making it to the uh, to TI. TI is the tournament, the international. And then uh, they lost all their games, like everyone kind of expected. Everyone just kind of said they were outclassed. Whatever, like the it's good that they're here. It's their first their first TI. And then, uh, so there's like two brackets, there's an upper bracket and a lower bracket. Like if you lose in the upper bracket, you get knocked down. So these dudes, uh, round one, get knocked to the lower bracket and everyone's like, this is what we expected. And then they proceed to win and, and whoop everybody. I don't know. They, cr they kind of like unlocked something and had this crazy momentum. And these, these five dudes, like all like really young guys, just, uh, just figured it out and uh took it all the way and like there's this like one chinese team that uh everyone was expecting to to win the whole thing i mean they these guys are really good uh they've they've been training for for two years for this super calculated cold like strategic like they're just really good and, and super uh, super good at the game and and these guys they, they beat them and uh, before that, like to even make it into the finals, they had to beat the best team in Europe. When everyone was like, "It was a good run here," but these guys are going to beat them, and he and they beat them as well. It was it was incredible. <clears throat> it was kind of strategy. It, it's a mix between strategy and and play style. Um, I mean, they just played with a lot of a lot of heart. They took. I mean, these guys like when they made top three, they became millionaires. I mean, the top prize at this at this tournament was. Uh, the, the winners took home 18 million million dollars. Second place was, um, what was it? Uh, like 
12 million or something like that or like hey, it's a lot and uh so uh, already just making it to third place like they were going to be millionaires and so they they essentially can't lose and so they they made so they took so many risky plays or they did the thing like they pushed the boundaries uh that maybe other teams that are afraid of losing up until that point wouldn't take so they just played really aggressively it was super fun to watch they they did like uh figure out some things strategically that i think other teams were like more uh there's this like one strategy that that was just like very popular that people like teams were using to to beat other teams and a lot of people had kind of written it off as completely <coughs> excuse me uh, entirely game breaking and so they would ban those heroes and they kind of figured out a way to beat it and so they could have so much more flexibility in their in their play style and draft because they they knew what to do anyway long story short been watching a lot of dota this weekend because it's been really fun and uh i'm gonna already pop one of these cough drops in so i don't hack on you guys the whole the whole stream we might might not go super late today uh just because i need my rest but we'll we'll go for a while hmm. yeah it was just super fun to watch, um, and it, it means even more. It's like the Cinderella story, you know, this underdog tale. You know, these these folks that no one expected them to even make it to the top five, much less top three, much less second place, and then to actually win the whole damn thing. It was just, it was incredible. What is this? I'll leave that tab open. We'll look at that. Yeah, the 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 underdog story is just the best, you know. And uh, <clears throat> I I also don't pay a ton to sports. Uh, I got really excited once when I was young at watching hockey because uh, when I lived in North Carolina, the the Carolina Hurricanes had their breakout season. And they made it to the Stanley Cup Finals. I was super hyped for that. So I got into it a little bit. But um, um, yeah, they got completely destroyed by the Detroit Red Wings. And then that journey was over. But it was a fun run. And I do still like hockey a lot. Uh, but I was literally the only person in my whole city, I think, that cared about it in the South. Uh, it's football or basketball. And... Maybe baseball, but no one cares about hockey. And um, <clears throat> yeah, this is this is like esports, so it's even weirder because um, people are like video games. You don't you watch people play video games? I'm like you don't understand. These people are on another level. So where um, where do we leave? Where do we leave off? Um, last time took some uh some screenshots here some stuff from unsplash some inspiration <coughs> excuse me you're just gonna i'm gonna be coughing for the whole day <clears throat> so this thing's a mood i like it um so i think what i what we'll do is i'll i'll scratch on this for or maybe uh, I don't know 45 minutes an hour or something we'll draw some stuff and then we'll switch over to Sable we'll do some Sable play that for a little while and then we'll call it a night no I mean I I'm on the uh, I'm on the mend I'm feeling better overall it's just uh, it's always the you know the last part of a cold it's kind of this like uh, the coughs and stuff. I'm feeling feeling much better overall. And uh So what do you say? 
What do we add to this? I'm also going to have to have this cough drop in my mouth the whole time. I think we got to have something on the trail here. I was thinking maybe like a, we made it like a cobblestone kind of thing. Kind of maybe going up and around. That could be cool. I think we just need some textures here. I think this, uh, some of this tree stuff, we can just make this um, <clears throat> a little bit nicer just by kind of uh, hiding some of these through shapes. Essentially just kind of doing doing this business uh, where we I just kind of put it on a couple layers back here. So you don't really see through it. You know, we're just building out the shapes. small rains of terrain there. You mean like in the woods over here? <clears throat> Take these little points where you just kind of see the land behind it. So so good. We can do better. Let's put some of these back here. chill song like a big tree over here I'm just kind of have to give it this texture oh like logs in your house yeah we can do that mm -hmm. I think we should definitely add some more to the to the cabin a little bit give it some love Yeah, I want to do some more, um, uh, some more drawings, like some some more painting stuff. Um, I, I have I have a couple pieces I've kind of started on uh, my own off stream, but I haven't really committed to any of them. I think I posted some of them in Discord. I think they look cool. Um, Maybe they're worth, um, I don't know, giving a second, second, second look. I feel like we should put something else down here, like, kind of about this high. I made that a little too big. Let's go, let's go like right here. Bear with me. Um, yeah, about right there. And what I'm gonna I'm gonna make this thing flat, on both ends. And is this the top end? I think I'll make that. Yeah. Kind of want to make it kind of misty, but maybe we don't make it like totally white. Like we'll already make this kind of like. 50% or something like that. Yeah, right? Something like that. And we can even kind of play with it and have this whole area be even more foggy back here, you know? even have like different colors slightly yeah we can make this one like even kind of kind of gray on this end <coughs> excuse me um oh yeah it's kind of interesting because we can play with the colors here i mean it doesn't need to look like a techno disco going on down there but we could um just mean like we could play with like give it a little bit more punch you know like there's something else go like some, some of this yellow light maybe
maybe it's maybe it's more of this blue kind of color. Go a little bit more like that. It kind of gives it like a nice, nice misty kind of vibe. Like maybe there's like a Dig it. What else should we add? <clears throat> should we make this house a little bit more interesting? Um, Saturated. Unsaturated oranges are really difficult to work with because they always end up looking, um, they always end up looking like a brown. I just kind of want to give this the effect that like light is, it looks really close to the ground color. I don't really like that. I do like this color orange. effect that there's like some light hitting it you know it doesn't have to be a lot just a little bit something so it's not so flat and then let's like let's touch it for the um let's get make this roof like a little bit more interesting um a little bit more cabiny and let's maybe like Let's just see how this works here. See, like, look how unstraight this line is. Like, it's really unstraight. So I gotta kind of make it up. <clears throat> I find it charming that it's such a weird uh, line. No, it's not straight. I don't really want to change that. thinking maybe we go for more like this kind of color so this is like the shadows just kind of bleeding into it I think that's a bit nicer so these will need to um, very subtly adjust to line up with the windows this look a little bit closer here. Oops. Maybe I'll just spread them out more. Because this one needs to be like parallel. It's just like, um, it's kind of like these, these, uh, so it's like a, just so it looks more like a cabin. Like it's these, these, these like wooden paneling. See how like when we zoom out, it kind of looks like these. It's just like wood, wood panels, you know? I think we'll put them over here too. Just space these out. Just gives the whole thing some texture. You can just sit back here. You don't have to do a whole lot. But already I can see that helping quite a bit. Let's maybe make these a little bit darker. Since they're on the back side. Ah, it matches the shadow. Wait, let's not touch it. Let's not mess with it. 
we'll play with this in a little bit. That should be like kind of parallel to that. All right. Still a little to the roof. Let's um, let's play with that boy a little. Bit. <clears throat> so we have a couple options. We can make it like shingles. Hey, Jelly Duck. It's good seeing you. How are things? I'm a little. I have a little bit of a cold, so you have to excuse my coughing and my kind of. My uh, scratchy voice. <clears throat> um, I'm not really sure what I want here. We could do something like this where we just kind of go through here. Let's see. Let's just add some points and try it. Or I could just kind of raise it like this. Just raise each of these slightly. I need to adjust that shadow there. It's fine. It's no problem. There's a nice chimney, you might say. Well, thank you. Kind of look like Batman's roof. Um, But I think what we could do is if we do the same thing on top and then add some like some slits on it. So let's maybe just draw those first because then it'll be easier. Because I'm kind of I'm kind of making up the perspective as I go, which isn't the best. Let's make this thing uh, like bright pink, <clears throat> bright pink, bright pink. Uh, just so I can see it. Otherwise, uh, we're not going to leave it bright pink. I just won't be able to tell where I'm drawing lines. Otherwise. So if I if I draw these perfectly straight here, let's just see how this looks. I don't think this is going to look right. Because uh, they're not drawn in perspective. But I just want to just gonna look at it. We're just going to see. Maybe it'll be fine. So, that's a a little bit wonky. This one needs to be further along. Something like that. We need a, a, a hydrate redeem. I've got plenty of liquids here. I'm, as soon as I finish this cough drop, I'm gonna give it a go for a hydration hydration break. Yeah, drawing perspective stuff without any kind of uh, guides, do not recommend. It's a zero out of ten experience. So, um, yeah, we, we're not going to keep these. Uh, these are just, you know, it'll make sense in a second. I'm not going to explain. Um, okay, so I'm just going to add some points here. It'll all make sense. Don't you worry. Hope everyone's doing good. Not catching the cold. Be sure to stay hydrated. Mm, I messed that up. Here we go. Okay. We removed the stroke there. And then let's... Um, Take this color and let's just make it slightly brighter. Oops. Let's 
Spending money working on the house. What kind of projects you get going? Are you like renovating or is it the new stuff? I don't know if this roof is going to work out. You could say I've been working on the roof myself. No, I, I didn't do I didn't do a whole lot of anything this weekend. I barely made it off the couch. <clears throat> and that's the that's the way. Oh, you didn't have proper light. Okay. Yeah, so a lot of a lot of building up. Get the staples in place. That's important. That takes a lot of time too. <clears throat> okay, that we'll just kinda go back there. I don't really need to see all this. Actually none of this will be seen. But I'm still gonna draw it, because it might I make it opaque. <laughs> this roof needs one. Chill tunes. Aggressively saying, or like, uh, <laughs> okay. excuse me, good sir. Hypothetically, if I wanted to select the other, yeah, I'm gonna make this gradient. this roof a bit more let's let's zoom out and look at this boy i think this is a cool it kind of looks like one of these like tin roofs you know oh lots of lights cool curtains man you've been you've been on the upgrade very nice that's good that stuff's important all right hydration time That's the stuff. Okay. I think uh, these need to be slightly more transparent. Makes a difference, right? We should also then kind of do something like that so it's on the other side too. <clears throat> yeah, and so I mean we should fix this thing because it's kind of in the middle of uh of this thing, so we should kind of pull it down, make it look like it. We're going in. 
looks kind of weird. Um, I think it's like over here more. Maybe this is just a weird place for a chimney. That actually looks okay, but this is kind of strange because it's kind of small. the intro I think it's okay we'll just roll with it maybe we change it later okay so uh let's let's add let's add a few more deets um what do you say um Yeah, we need to add the song before. It was Seaside Park <clears throat> by Hu Gui and Hai Jude. It's a good one. Hey, Mike. I got a bit of a cold, Mike. So, how you doing, man? Let's just listen to that one again. It was a good one. Mike, how was uh, how's New Worlds? I wanted to watch your stream the other day, but I, I couldn't couldn't get to it because I was crashed out because I had this cold, you know. But uh, how are you doing? Just just doing the gunship reminder thing. Thank you. We should listen to some gunship, but we gotta we gotta get some hype energy behind it, you know. Like I gotta get I gotta get. I gotta get stoked for that. <clears throat> and I'll probably end up singing it and then I'll start coughing. It's gonna be a whole nightmare. Is this really what we want? I thought, didn't you tweet that you're playing New World? The MMO? Was that a joke tweet? That's a joke tweet. I got so bamboozled. Wait, you guys have computers? Um, okay. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I thought it was on maybe the PS17, whatever it is that you kids are using these days. I also, I mean, I use a Mac for a lot, although I, need, I like my gaming PC. Did we like half convince Mike in Discord the other day to get a, a gaming PC? Because I kind of feel like I remember that. Yo, Raz, man. Dude, what's good? Dude, uh, I appreciate that. Wow. Thank you, man. How you been? Okay, I'm gonna try to put together, I think, like a cobblestone path here. Cobblestone path. I'll just use some, some stonage here. pretty good it's good to hear man uh, I'm just uh, scratching on this piece that I started was it last week it's kind of like cabin cabin in the woods kind of kind of vibe and um, no I'm gonna maybe play some sable here in like I don't know 15 20 minutes and uh, continue that story that was really fun do you, do you guys do you know Sable Raz? I know I know Mike and Mike and Miguel do. Uh, thank you, uh, 
Raz, I don't know if I said it for your never never ending support. I I appreciate you, man. Let's um Let's continue on this on this on this here rock. We like rocks. We like drawing rocks. Rocks are, are nice. Um, I mentioned it earlier, but uh, yeah, I've been been watching a ton of Dota this weekend because it was the the world the world championship of that, and it's uh, it was a, it was a good one. It was a goodie. Uh, super interesting and exciting. Minerals, Marie. They're called minerals. <laughs> no worries. No worries. So I'm kind of thinking this is what we'll do. Um, <clears throat> so I kind of just want to put like this rock path of like some of these like kind of bigger stones and then I'll put like maybe a few little grassy things between them I get it you get it you get it metals Murray all I'm doing now for those uh, drawing with me at home I know there are dozens of you uh, with your your styluses and your um, your affinities open. Uh, all I'm doing here is duplicating the shape, kind of giving this uh, a different shape and a shadow by multiplying the shape, color, and then moving on. Um, and then we're just kind of doing that again. I kind of ended up making the same shape, so I don't I don't really want to do that. But I also don't want to draw 10,000 of these, so I'm going to make some bigger ones. Odorless paint thinner. <clears throat> so, Mike, what what... I got bigger questions now. First of all, who who do I think you are on Twitter? And second, uh, did you stream recently? Because I thought you said stream a new world this evening. I'm really confused. <laughs> I saw you're back on the triple XP train, though. I haven't I haven't watched those yet. Listen to those. Oh yeah, maybe it was cheese. Maybe it was cheese. We gotta wish this around. We gotta mix up the the sediment on the bottom. Um, I think I'm gonna adjust this slightly. Do you guys like Wes Anderson movies? What, what's the best Wes Anderson movie that you've uh, you've seen? What's your favorite? I had this discussion. Uh, recently <laughs> with a friend of mine. Cheese has some profile pic. Yeah. You've been streaming Hades. Oh, that could be fun. Have you guys changed anything in the format? Or is it kind of just a return to the... Return to the crew? Sorry. Gotta really focus on not letting all this settle. You stop drinking it for two seconds, everything. I really love Hades. I haven't yet uh, finished it. Uh, maybe, maybe I change this. Maybe like this rock path goes over here, and like maybe I rework this this whole section of land to maybe actually be like a 
like a trail that maybe goes to like the front of the cabin, you know? Let's like rework this. Yeah, I haven't beat Poppy yet. Shorter, but more focused. I So, okay, I mean, that I told it to you, but that was my biggest criticism, is that it was just a tad on the long side. And don't get me wrong, I love a meandering podcast as much as the next uh, the next nerd, but um, sometimes I got, I got other stuff to listen to, you know? Gotta, gotta distill it. Give me the good stuff that happened. Yeah, I think an hour is a good... It's a good, good number. Well, that's cool, man. It's good to see you guys are doing it again. It's happening. I'm just gonna just rotate this guy. <clears throat> I like, I'm, I'm really into this idea I have going, brewing here. Uh, I'm just gonna have this trail that just kind of goes up here every two weeks. So a fortnightly podcast. Yes, I said fortnightly. Never miss an opportunity to use the word fortnightly in a sentence. Didn't grow up with that one. It was always, I, I kid you not. Whenever uh, I, I had that, I remember having that word in like my fourth grade vocabulary class, and it was. I think the definition they wrote in our book was a British word for two weeks. So got to use it in a sentence whenever possible. Yeah, exactly. And that's, uh, it's true. It used to be like a, a $7 college word. And now it's, uh, now it's every punk's, punk's word. Bunch of punks. No, I don't care. Um, let's see here. Let's build in the shadow. <clears throat> good cadence though might do it that often it seems good I'll uh, I'll tune into the next the next episode give it a old, the old listen the old college listen that's like a college try but you don't have to actually try because you're just you're just listening actually I did want to do that no I want to copy paste that and then this is what I, I went the wrong way. But I want like a lighter and darker version of that, but not so dark as the other ones. Like that just looks that just looks bad. Coming out of the shadow, man. <clears throat> yeah. What is this? Get, get me out of here. I need, I need some more jam in my music. Give me a bass line. Something. Give me something. That 
That one has a baseline. Let's go. Nah, dude. I I asked. I am happy for you. No, it's uh, it's dope. I want to give it a listen. I I don't actually. I I need to fix it because uh, I was just watching it on YouTube always, but I don't really list, get my podcast from YouTube that much. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I mostly have like a came from a podcast app, so. I need to, uh, I need to get triple XP on my, on there, you know what I'm saying? drop too. We got it. We got to reload. <clears throat> oh, you switched to providers. Okay. percent of that like we were still chipping chipping points of that what's good hey hey audrey how are you i don't think i can handle a tarkov stream for what it's worth i think uh that i my adrenaline is pumping enough as is no need to bring no need to bring uh heavy weapons into this. Let's see here. All right, we're just gonna get this, this pathway kind of done, and then we're gonna switch to some Sable, which I'm excited for. starting to think we were like memeing them or something um so that was weird uh but now we have we, we've 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 hence bought onions and it's no longer become a problem um so that's good but yeah yeah you gotta you gotta remember to buy stuff it's the worst wish it wasn't like that 
Alright, I just got this little shadow shape that I'm just kind of wiggling around back here. Just giving it the old one, too. Ah, oh, Crafters on Vacation. I haven't seen that guy in a while. Let me, um, let me pull up a... How do I do this again? I always forget how to do it. Um... There's like a way I can do like the... Bear with me, studio. Here we go. Uh, we're close, we're close. Navigator, that's the thing I was looking for, this thing. So when I'm zoomed in, working on a rock, y'all can see it. <clears throat> see, see where I am? I'm there. Let's make this a little smaller. The last rock, maybe, 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 maybe two more rocks. I don't know. I'm gonna smash, it, make it small. Yeah, not having fun with this cold. Kind of wishing that would just go away, but it is what it is. Just move, move our little shadow boy up here. Just move them down. But yeah, super chill weekend overall. Mostly just been lounging on the couch, watching Dota and taking naps, trying to get uh, get a bit better, recover. <clears throat> Loving this this little trail here. This is this is great. A million dollar idea. Wait, what did I miss here? the sword yeah yeah miguel is a, a mod now he's always so helpful and present in the streams and um he's just a good dude and i need all the the darn help i can get <clears throat> so you better be good or else he'll ban you he's drunk on power nothing can stop him this is the last rock we'll, we'll draw, I swear. And then and we'll be done drawing rocks. For now. Uh, Dota's done. Unless you're talking about me playing it. Because uh, I, I, I still play it. Played a few rounds before stream. Um, no, the... Uh, yeah, it's finished. The uh, I, I gave a little rundown at the beginning of the stream, but... Uh, uh, it was super fun tournament to watch because the uh, the team that won it was a like a crazy huge underdog like literally it's so like uh, in the in game there's like a bracket for like the whole tournament people can like fill out their bracket for how everything's gonna gonna um, turn out and people not a single person guessed the team that won they were they were uh, entirely unheard of. No one had ever seen them before, really. Uh, just like some some players from Ukraine and Russia, and they they smashed the best teams in the world, and it was really fun to watch because no one expected it. Yeah, it looks the same, but I can't really change the mountain color. Yeah, right. It was it was great. Um, I mean, it, it's a it's a wild tournament. It's a, I mean, it's really long. Takes a lot of time to watch it. But and if you don't really know Dota, it can also be kind of exhausting. I bet because there's just a lot going on, a lot to learn. But um, if you're interested in the game, it is it was a it's a fascinating time to to watch it after the at the international. The dudes, uh, I mean, they went from like in the past six years, their team had made something like fifty thousand dollars, and today they pulled in in six years fifty thousand, and this year they pulled in 
or, or today because they won that tournament 18 million 18 million dollar tournament it's incredible for first place Daniel says uh, imagine a football game but there if there was no uh, DQ in football then the footballers actually continue playing after someone injured them like with a speed debuff sounds like rugby to me Rugby doesn't stop. It also kind of sounds like a, what's that one? Uh, Blood Bowl? Blood Bowl? Is that a game? Blood Bowl? Where it's like a fantasy football game? Like, is it even Warhammer? Yeah. No, it's not Warhammer, but it's Warhammer Lite. I never played that, but. I think it's a good stopping point for this piece. Uh, not hand egg. But football already doesn't stop. Like they never stop the play. Or at least the clock. I guess they do stop plays. Yeah. Could be neat. So it's like Rocket League, but with people. Yeah, the clock never stops. I think it's a good pause. Maybe next week we'll we'll add something else. But I love I love how this kind of builds out here. I'd like to add a little bit more detail in the mountain, or at least uh, at least on this one because it's so close to us. I'd like to clean up this a little bit. These trees look stamped I'd like to give them a little bit more definition hear me out what about dragon soccer add a flight element to it it's like Quidditch but uh, with fire I think there's something there yeah we'll add some more details as we go but let me um let me set up some Sable. Let's play some Sable for, for about 45 minutes or so. Yeah. Audrey, you can you can do the lore for the for the dragons and we'll figure out their various backstories. Um Miguel, are you in a place where you could change the category to be Sable? For me. So the zombie soccer, the rules are, there are no rules, except for... So are, are zombies playing soccer, or is it a fight to the death and you come back as a zombie? Or are zombies the balls? Uh, what are you excited about? 